Assalamu alaikum, it's Samir from Samir Seats. I'm cruising around in my local neighborhood in Ridgewood, New Jersey, and one of my favorite brunch spots is La Bonchois. It's a halal, French-inspired rotisserie chicken meal. Let's go on in and check it out. So I have the honor of sitting with the owner at Ahmed, uh, who started this awesome restaurant. So Ahmed, uh, tell us like what inspired you to start this restaurant? What makes you feel awesome? Okay, so it was started two years ago. Uh, I guess the inspiration came from like avoiding the market for good wholesome food. So basically, the whole concept here it's minimally processed food. It's natural ingredients, and I guess that makes everything possible. Awesome. Yeah, so I understand the chicken is raised locally, um, and right down the street, I guess. Yes, off a road farm, like okay. less than two miles from the store. Awesome. It's 100% vegetarian fed, it's certified halal. And uh, we've been having this relationship with the farm like right. years right. ago from previous restaurants, like over five years. And when we work in the halal certification with them and all that, we have well, we have good relationship with them now to be able to have good price, then we can provide good product. Good yeah, product. no, it's definitely high quality product and you can taste it in the food. Cool. Uh, any, you know, you have this location here in Ridgewood, uh, you have another location in, in Manhattan in Hell's Kitchen. Any plans on expanding or opening up another one? Yes, we are working on it now and hopefully with the beginning of the new year 2017, we'll be able to franchise in New Jersey first. Okay. And then we'll expand out from there. The plans so you're going to franchise? For, oh, okay, yes. great. Yes. Something to look out for. <laughs> yes. Awesome. So look, everything here is just like, we don't play with the food so much. We don't cook in high heat. All the ingredients are fresh. All the sauces are our own recipe. It's made in the store. We're making the small batches every one or two days. So I guess that makes a difference in the flavor. Cool, thank you. Well, look, uh, good luck with the expansion thank and the you. franchise, and thanks for having us. For sure. So when I come to Laban Chua, um, I have a couple things that I have to get here. Uh, but the way you can get the rotisserie chicken in, you either get it by itself or you can get it in the form of a sandwich. Now they offer five different sandwiches and my favorite happens to be the Cote Ron. So the Cote Ron is obviously a rotisserie chicken. It's sitting on a brioche bun. It's topped with gruyere and espresso barbecue sauce. So they also offer Baku style. Baku style is simply a fried egg and a crispy chicken skin. And I'm telling you, it's worth it. It's, it's an extra three bucks, but it does wonders to the sandwich. This is gonna be interesting. So it's hard to pull me away from the sandwich because uh, it's absolutely my favorite when I come here. Uh, but when you bite into it, you're tasting the barbecue sauce, the egg yolks running, you got the gruyere. Uh, man, this brioche bun is nice and toasty. Mm. Most importantly, the freshness of this rotisserie chicken, unmatched. You can tell it's fresh, free range. And I'm telling you, this is probably one of the healthiest things I probably eat. Healthy, oh, in my world. I also feel a nice crunch because they added some coleslaw in there too. So I have a little room left and you're in for a treat. Uh, no, actually I'm in for a treat. Uh, I got the half rotisserie chicken. It comes with a side, which I got roasted potatoes, and a choice of sauce, which I got the blank barbecue sauce. And you get cornbread, high quality, gluten-free cornbread. So, I'm gonna dig in and see how far I make it. You can smell that rotisserie. Mm, fresh chicken. Just take a little dip into that blank barbecue sauce. The chicken is so moist and juicy inside, it's because they slow cook it for about four hours. And you get that crunch from the chicken skin. It's nice and crispy. So as Ahmed mentioned, they, they get the chicken locally. It's, it's zabia, it's halal. Um, you know, you could definitely taste the freshness. I mean, there's a, it's not a frozen chicken, it's fresh. Like literally, they get it from the farm and they brine it and then they throw it into that rotisserie oven. 
and it sits there for four hours. And I come and eat it all up. So I'm trying to squeeze in a little bit of the roasted potatoes, but I may have to take it to go. Uh, but the cool thing is they mix the regular potatoes with the sweet potatoes. So you got the best of both worlds. The cornbread is homemade, it's gluten-free, it's fresh, it's sweet, it's not dried out. This isn't dessert. We're, we're about to go to dessert. Just hang on. This is the chocolate banana bread pudding with a scoop of vanilla ice cream and some chocolate syrup drizzled on top. So the bread is warm and soft. And the ice cream is cold and soft. They both complement each other very well. Wow. I mean, what's neat is it is a banana bread pudding, but the chocolate empowers it. So if you don't like bananas, you'll still love this. All right, folks, so be sure to check them out for some halal rotisserie chicken right here in Ridgewood, New Jersey. They also have a location at Hell's Kitchen in Manhattan. So come on in, have yourself some rotisserie chicken. I'll catch you on the next episode. Salam alaikum. Oh, and be sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Samir's Eats, it's where it's at. See you soon.